Okay, have we start recording? Yes, we have. Hello, everybody. My name is Regular Gamer Alex, and welcome back once again to Poppy's Playtime Chapter 2. Okay, so last time we got a bit of a surprise. We had a Bonzo's little mini game puzzle, as well as one with many uh, woogies, and that was both. <sighs> both of them were so. Oh boy, I'm surprised I didn't die once at either of them. Because <laughs> my focus, reaction time, basically me versus puzzles, basically. But one thing we did find out. Kissy, the pink version of Huggy Wuggy, might be an ally. Because we literally see went over here and opened this gate for us, but didn't come after us. Instead, she just turned around and left. It's interesting. There's definitely a lot more going here. I don't know what's over here, but I made it. Why is it so dark? Why is there never a flashlight when you need one? Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. Why do we need these for Barry? Who's Barry? Okay, not too bad of a puzzle. This is actually pretty simple. Uh-oh. God dang it. God dang it, Bobby. Or I'm just back over here, I guess. Okay, I wonder what the next one is. Probably one that said statues. But first, we have another tape to watch. Let's listen to this one. Oh, a person! I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not at all, sir! That's what I'd like to hear. Huh, I wonder who this is. Hmm. <laughs> First, he was in a murder house, that game made by Puppet Combo, and now he's in Bobby's Playtime. So, uh, Sean Chris, McLaughlin. What happened? You see, I was heading home for the day when my apars realized that I left me bloody wallet in the cafeteria. <laughs> so I'm running through the lobby, and that's when I see it. A mob handle lodged under the innovation wing gate. So what you do, Marcus? Well, I just thought I'd nab the bloody yoke and be on me merry way. And? Well, I'm reaching for the thing, and the mob handle jolts on its own. Had me scared stiff. I thought I was the only one there. So, I, I took a peek beneath the gate, and some massive bloody thing was dothering about the bloody hallway. Thing? You're sure it wasn't a person? Ain't no person that's 50 feet long with a thousand legs. Marcus, you're losing me. Maybe you just saw a bunch of people walking by. Look, it wasn't people, all right? I have a bloody notion what it was, but it wasn't human. Who have you told about this? Besides me, obviously. Just you, sir. Obviously. Idiot. Okay. I'll You're about to die. Skim the cameras and take a look. What? There's a massive bloody monster! Skimming ain't gonna get rid of it! You're out of line, Marcus. We make toys, not monsters. Now come on, get out of my sight. Actually, uh, grab me a coffee, will you? Actually, never mind. Get out of my sight. Sean McLaughlin, also known as Jack Sabrikai, one of the YouTubers that inspired me to become a YouTuber. And he's also in this game. <laughs> oh, that is awesome. That is amazing. It's always fun playing a game with one of your inspirations are also in the game. <laughs> No! 
No! I wasn't quick enough. God dang, I wasn't quick enough. But that's still so cool. So Jack Jacksepticeye is in this game for that little brief cameo. But his character in this game is probably dead now. He witnessed something and he only told one person. No, you tell multiple people. Because when you do that, it's less likely that you'll disappear. Yes, Barry. Come on, Barry, we're going for a trip. And down you go, Barry. Where does that lead? Ooh, I feel like we made noise you probably shouldn't have been making. Well, I think should be fine still. Hopefully. And down we go. How have we not broken our legs or anything yet? I thought those were real... For a second. Oh. I just realized where we're at. Yeah. Ugh. One more left. And then that's it. This last one is probably you. Have you played these before? You're so good. Seems like you're ready for the final game, Statues. Follow Mommy down the stairs one last time. Hope you had a fun day at the game station. See hmm. you next time. <coughs> oh. Okay. I think I know what this one's going to be about. This one's going to be about uh, PJ uh, Pillowpug. A caterpillar pug creature thing. This might be what Jack said guy saw. Well, I mean, <laughs> what his character in this game saw. Many legs. <sighs> this is probably what he saw. Oh boy, what's this one gonna look like? It's probably gonna chase us. Oh god, that's a scary thought. What the? Parameter battery. What is this thing? I'm stuck. Okay. Okay. Puzzle time. Do you want to play with PJ? Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, no, thank you. No, thank you at all, my dear friend. That was my mistake. infuriating what did 
There we go. So now the door should be open or something like that. Okay, I'll see what this one's gonna be about. Why is it gotta be dark? It's an obstacle. Oh no no no! It's a chase. It's a f it's a chase. Oh. Welcome to statues. Is that a chase? This advanced obstacle course is designed to test your physical endurance and strength. The rules are simple. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna the lose. The lights will turn off. You can move through the obstacle course at this time. However, when the lights turn on, you can look around but cannot move. I see. You may move again once the lights turn back off. The lovable PJ Pugapillar will follow you. If PJ reaches you, your test is over. That's all. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> okay. Open a bloody gate. Open a bloody gate. Mommy, now's not the time. So sad to see the kids go. They call me mommy because I was the closest thing they ever had to one. But they That's a bit for uh, games and never come back. They left mommy to die alone. Mommy didn't deserve that. But you you worked here. So if anyone deserves to die... How does she know I worked here? It's you. Good, I'm out, I'm out. I hate this, I hate this. Oh, sweet. What am I supposed to do there? I'm kind of hanging around here. It's not over. Get up. Okay, thanks, encouraging words, I guess? Who's saying that? Or is it just like a death screen type of thing? I don't know if that was the lights or he just caught up to me. That, that one's hard. That one's hard. I never said it'd be easy. Who's saying this? I'm dead. This is a bit weird. Who's saying this? How the hell do I get to this obstacle course if I can't move? For a good part of it. Nobody is here by choice. Who was saying this? Get up. Okay. I survived all these other ones. This is the ones that I die on. This one game. Whoa. Why does my character. Why? What, what is that? Uh, 
I don't know where he is. I don't want to turn around. Medium. I'm not supposed to be. What the? That one went on for way too long. It's going on for way too long. Why is it doing that? It, what? I don't understand. Where am I supposed to go here? Where is he going? This one is very difficult. He is loose. Who? Who? This is Mercy Lockdown. I don't understand this one. Don't tell me I do this whole thing all over again. Please don't tell me I do that. I hate everything. What am I supposed to do at the last one, though? That's my question. I guess this time I'll go towards easy. He is climbing up like that, huh? Shorter, shorter, I don't like it. And I still don't know where to go on this one.
He's coming up here. What, what, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, there's a hole. was exceptionally hard. That's probably the only one I've actually died on. Mommy long legs and family. She has a family. How dare you disobey me? I will find you. I will find you. And when I do, <laughs> where are you? Where are you? Mommy long legs, daddy long legs, I guess baby long legs? Or short legs from Mike Till. Interesting. Is it slanted? Or am I just going crazy? Well, that puzzle is definitely one of the most difficult ones I've done, or the most difficult one. <sighs> but how are we going to get to code? Because she kind of wants to kill us at the moment. She's kind of being... Oh, I guess I can reach that far. A fire's person, not only, I'm pretty sure I count. Can we, I can't even use E on that one door. Okay. Water treatment? Wait, what? Ooh. I will find it. Uh, transfer request. Experiment 1222. Mommy Longleg. Subject. Mary Payne. Mommy Longlegs has the unique ability to stretch any of her limbs for several hundred feet. This includes her fingers, arms, hair, neck, waist, legs. She's very hostile towards the staff, but is very lovely and acts warmly towards the other experiments. She is protective of them. Okay, so it does seem like they're transferring people into the toys. Subject was someone named Mary Payne? The hostility is quickly becoming problematic, but perhaps there is a solution to put her in place. My long legs will be perfect for facilitating anything with the children in the game station. She has the warmth that a mother should, and any rowdy child can learn to listen to their mother. Oh, it makes sense that her seeing the children daily would improve her behavior. It is very unlikely she will act out in front of children. Have her transferred to high security maintenance immediately. Conditioning can begin. Interesting. Have I missed any of those, like notes? I might have. Huh. If I've missed any notes, I need to look back and make sure. If I do, didn't miss any notes, I'll make sure to bring them up in like an extra video or something if I need to. Ah, uh, come on. I know there's another tape somewhere. Show me the tape. Potato man ball thing. Oh, I'm very sure he's kicked me, Paul. Okay. Okay. But where's this other uh, thing? Can I actually jump down here or like... Yeah, that's kind of my fault there. This isn't about you. Okay. And who are you? Who's the one who's saying these? Hmm. 
There's nothing I can do with those things then. But I need to find a green tape of some sort. Okay. find that green tape. I need my tapes. I need a lore. Toy scanner. Okay, it seems I need to make another toy. Uh, the buzzing bee guy. I forget what they're called. Bonzo bunny. No. Why is it copy Bonzo? Meow, 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 bun. Meow, 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 buzz. Okay then. Oh. Well, oh, I'm going high up. Why am I going high up? Grab onto the thing! Jeez! Okay, let's head back down and assess this from the bottom. Those scratch marks are not good. Go up to the blue. They just get dropped off. Okay, so I need to definitely change that. Oh, I guess that's kind of why I needed. Grab the thing, jeez. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. That's a cool little thing. But now I need to do this whole thing again. Try to make over there, scanner. I'm being dumb, I'm being dumb, I'm being so dumb. I forgot to look for tapes. Tape? 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 Oh my god. <laughs> Tape? Tape? Tape, tape, Jesus, uh, hi. I have two of them. Why not, I guess? Tape, tape, tape. Tape, 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 tape. No tape. Come on, need a VHS tape.
90 degrees, and then one more 90 degrees, and we should be good. There we go. I still am determined to find this tape. I will give me that tape. No matter what. Bonzo Bunny. Tape. 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 Give me the tape. Give me the Carfax. Give me the tape. <laughs> Wait, what? A red one now? Wait, I still need to find green, huh? No, no, no. I need to find other ones first. I am determined to find other ones. Where's the other ones? No green hand, huh? What about blue? Huh, eyeball man? Oh, there was a puzzle I was supposed to do in there first. I keep making the same mistake. see the puzzle. Bada boom. exactly was this room? Were they doing testings in this room? I still need to find these other <sighs> tapes. I need these tapes. I want to know the story. Give me the... Ow. My legs. Give me my story. Give me my tapes. Where were the tapes? <gasps> I'm screwed, I'm screwed, I'm screwed. This is the chase. This is full on chase. Oh, heaven mercy me. Oh my god. This is a straight up chase. I don't like that weird stutter that just happened. It's way too quiet. I don't know what's happening. I'm scared.
Where am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go here? Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, no. Why is Gabi chasing here? No, 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 no. I hate these. No, I could have grabbed that trophy. Dang it. Oh. Warren Bach Construction Company. This is Eddie responding once again on behalf of Playtime Code Toy Factory. Yes, it must be in complete secrecy. This product should only be known about by those with the authority at Warren Bach and those with the authority here at Playtime. As promised, you will be compensated very well for your secrecy. Upwards of 100000 I mean. Keep in mind that this is a ballpark figure. Willing to provide you proper equipment needed for excavation. However, if you more independently, you are able to work. The more compensation I can offer. We like to see the lab completed in 12 months' time, but what's most important is that it's done right. Let me know if these terms work for you. I had to negotiate until we find something that both parties can be happy with. Take care, Eddie M. N. Ritterman. Okay, well, I'm leaving the video here, y'all. Because. Whew. I'm really sure we're getting closer and closer to the end of this. I don't know how much longer this chapter has, but we'll see you in the next one. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It supports me and the channel. And if you guys have any gaming recommendations at all, do leave it in the comments down below. But until then, I will see you guys next video. Stay awesome.